How you doing everybody? My name is Dr. Sami Baya. Please welcome back to my YouTube channel. What happens when a narcissist tries to destroy a chosen one? That is the title of this video. When a narcissist targets someone they perceive as a chosen one or a threat to their control, a variety of manipulative and destructive behaviors can unfold. When a narcissist tries to destroy someone that we call a chosen one, someone who is a threat to their sense of superiority or control, several dynamics may unfold. Now, what happens? Number one thing that happens when a narcissist tries to destroy a chosen one is that there will be intense manipulation and gaslighting. Remember, narcissists are master manipulators. They are highly skilled at manipulation and gaslighting. They distort reality and make the victim doubt their own perceptions and sanity. They might use lies, half-truths, and manipulation tactics to undermine the chosen one's credibility and support. The other thing that happens when a narcissist tries to destroy a chosen one, there will be character assassination. Narcissists may launch a campaign to discredit the chosen one's reputation or character. This could involve spreading rumors, making false accusations, or highlighting any perceived flaws to tarnish their image in the eyes of others. When a narcissist tries to destroy a chosen one, there will be emotional and psychological abuse. The narcissist will engage in emotional abuse tactics such as verbal attacks, belittling, or withholding affection and validation. The narcissist may also use psychological abuse techniques to instill fear, self-doubt, and dependency in their target. When a narcissist tries to destroy a chosen one, there will be isolation and alienation. This will take place because the narcissist needs to maintain control. They will therefore attempt to isolate the chosen one from their support network of trusted friends, of trusted family members, of trusted colleagues. When the narcissist isolates the chosen one from this support network, they are making them more vulnerable and easier to manipulate. Another thing that happens when a narcissist tries to destroy a chosen one is that they will be sabotaging and undermining. In professional or, profession or personal settings, narcissists might sabotage the chosen one's efforts or undermine their achievements to maintain their own position of power or superiority. Narcissists will use strangulation where they involve a third party to create jealousy, rivalry, or confusion among those involved. This tactic destabilizes relationships and creates emotional turmoil for the chosen one. When a narcissist destroys a chosen one, there will be escalation to physical violence. When a narcissist feels their control is slipping away, or when their attempts at emotional manipulation is failing, they may escalate to physical violence or threats to intimidate and regain dominance. Remember, the main goal of a narcissist is to destroy the chosen one's sense of self-worth, autonomy, and independence. Therefore, they reinforce their own sense of superiority and control to achieve this. The chosen one, when they are being destroyed by narcissists, there will be smear campaigns going on. The narcissists will spread rumors and lies to discredit the chosen one. They will cut off the chosen one from their support networks. They will start by love bombing the chosen one with excessive affection. Then they will suddenly undermine and criticize them. We call that devaluation. The narcissist will also involve a third party to create jealousy or insecurity. This is all about triangulation. 
The narcissist will also accuse the chosen one of the narcissist's own flaws. We call it projection. The narcissist is a master manipulator. So they will use guilt, shame, or fear to control the chosen one. The narcissist will take advantage of the chosen one's kindness or resources. They will undermine the chosen one's efforts or opportunities. And this is what we call sabotaging. The, chosen, the narcissist will dictate the, their behavior or decisions. In short, they will try to control the chosen one. They will also hoover the chosen one. That is, try to love bomb them back again. They will also dismiss the chosen one's thoughts, feelings, or experiences. The narcissist will disregard the chosen one's personal space or limits. In short, they'll violate the chosen one's boundary. They'll also use emotional blackmail. They will threaten the chosen one with consequences if they don't comply. The narcissist will try to control the chosen one's access to money or resources. They will also, the chosen one, the narcissist is also is entitled. They believe they deserve special treatment. They lack empathy. They will exaggerate their own achievements or importance. They will, they, they, the narcissist will dominate conversations or decisions. They will force the chosen one into decisions or actions against their will. The narcissist will withhold attention or affection as punishment to the chosen one. They will also threaten to leave or abandon the chosen one. They will express hostility indirectly. They will embarrass or shame the chosen one in front of others. The narcissist will never acknowledge the chosen one accomplishments or success the narcissist will turn everything into a contest or comparison they'll focus excessively on looks or status they'll portray themselves as the victim in every situation the chosen one will expect perfection or impossible standards they'll give attention only when it benefits them the narcissist will use children to manipulate the chosen one They'll also use threats or aggression to control the chosen one. The narcissist will refuse to communicate or engage with the chosen one. They will attack the reputation or character of the chosen one. We call that character assassination. The narcissist will blame the chosen one for things they didn't do. The narcissist will make sudden changes to destabilize them. The narcissist will justify controlling behavior as concern. The narcissist will divide allies to weaken support. They will also the narcissist will demand the impossible from the chosen one. They will also manipulate the chosen one through emotional obligations. The narcissist will make the chosen one question their own judgment. The narcissist will give attention only when it benefits them. Thank you for watching this video. I hope you've learned a thing or two. Please subscribe to my YouTube channel if you've not done so.